today with Tanya Burr. We have decided to film a video together today. Yeah, because we've never filmed together before and we met for coffee the other day in London. It was so nice. We actually decided just today. To yeah, literally. Video. This, is, this is like such a spontaneous video, but um, yeah, we thought we'd film together. Yay! Yeah. Uh, we decided to film a would you rather makeup tag? Yeah, basically. Um, and we have some questions to answer in the would you rather series. So we just thought we would answer those for you. There's quite a lot of questions. So we thought that we'd answer eight here on Zoe's channel. And so the video didn't get super duper long. We'd answer eight on my channel as yes. well. So we'll, we'll do that after this one. Yay. Question number one. Would you rather only be able to wear eye makeup or skin, like skin makeup? If you had to have one. Can we talk about situations? Like today, I'm feeling a little bit spotty, so I would have to go foundation. Yeah. But if I'm... my skin was looking really good and I just went on holiday, then I'd say eye makeup. Now, I would have to say skin, skin makeup. makeup. Definitely. Although, mascara always makes you look so much more awake. It does. It makes your eyes stand out. Because I always yeah. feel like I look like a little... Um, like shrimp-like thing. <laughs> I always think I look like a little piggy. You know, like yeah. pigs have really blonde, like, yeah, eyelashes. Like, yeah, that's what I feel like. And like, I'd have a nice kind of uh, made-up face and then my eyes would just be like, meh. <laughs> <laughs> Question number two. Would you rather chop off all your hair or never be able to cut your hair ever again? I wonder how long your hair could actually grow because I feel like my hair would grow to like here and then it just kind of stops and it kind of fizzles out at the ends. Yeah. So I feel like I would say never cut it just to be interested to see how long it would grow. Also, you would have more option for hairstyles because if you had to cut your hair right off, you'd be quite limited with what you could do with it. But if you had really just long hair, something. you could do her hair like the girl of Tangled. And when her hair gets really, it's, well, she has super, super long hair. And then she, when she gets out into the real world, they tie it up into this gorgeous, thick, like fishtail braid thing. I would that do would that. be amazing. I'd, yeah. get, I'd get Tangled hairdresser in on my hair. <laughs> the Disney Pixar Tangled yeah. hairdresser. <laughs> yeah. Where is she? <laughs> would you rather wear your clothes always too big or always too small? Oh, I have to say too big. Yeah, I think too big. Because also, you could use like belts and like... That's true. And also if they were too tight, you'd just be like either a little bulgy in areas. Yeah. <laughs> and you might get too hot and too, I don't know, too tight would make me feel claustrophobic. Yeah. <laughs> I'd just be like, oh, get me out. Yeah, I think baggy and then accessorise with it would yeah, be way better. Yeah, definitely. Question number four, if you had a thousand pounds to spend, would you buy clothes or makeup if you could only buy one? A thousand pounds. Do I already have my makeup and clothes collection that I've got already? Oh, don't know. If somebody literally said to you, okay, I've got a thousand pounds of vouchers, you can either have makeup or clothes, like now. I'd have clothes. Me because too, I think. I have a lot more makeup than I. I don't actually own that many clothes. I think you own a lot of clothes. From I watching own a lot of videos, clothes. you own a lot of clothes. <laughs> I do. <laughs> but then you'd get so much makeup for a thousand pounds, wouldn't you? Whereas yeah. clothes, you wouldn't really get. I mean, you could. You could get like a couple of really nice things. Or you could get like a Burberry leather jacket or something. If someone, yeah. If someone gave me a thousand pounds, I think I would probably get like one amazing thing with it or two amazing things. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's a good shout. I think I would do the same. Would you rather apply lipstick as eyeliner or eyeliner as lipstick? That's Ooh, a strange so one. So, so what colour eyelines? Could I only have like black and brown lips? Like classic eyeliner colours? Yeah. Like... And you'd have to have like pink and red and like nude eyes. That would be awful, so I'd rather probably have yeah. black lips. Yeah, your eyes would just look Imagine like... if you had this colour on your eyes right now and this colour on your lips. I would look so deranged, literally. I think it would, well, you'd look like you had an eye infection, wouldn't you? Yeah, it would look awful. Yeah, that's it, okay. I've got, like, nothing on my lips, but if I had this on my eyes, on my lips, it wouldn't be that bad. No, I don't think I had, so. Like, if you like, made it look cool, yeah, somehow. I think we could work with it as beauty gurus. Yeah, mm. I think we probably we could. could. Okay, here's one. Would you rather wear MC Hammer pants, or trousers, as we say here in yeah. the UK, or biker shorts in public? I'd say the MC Hammer pants because aren't they the ones that kind of go like quite baggy and then tighter at the bottom? They are bright gold, I think. Oh, really? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I really want to do the dance. Have you seen the dance for it? No. Is that how it goes? 
<laughs> you'd have to do that dance in public as well. You'd have to walk like that everywhere. <laughs> and what would I have to do if I was in bicycle shorts? Be like, I'm on a bicycle. Yeah, you'd have to be like. I don't know why my arms would do that on a bicycle. <laughs> <laughs> be more like this. <laughs> why are our bikes bouncing? <laughs> if I was having a really confident day, I'd probably wear biker shorts. But oh no, I don't know. I think more people gold. would stare at you in the gold MC in the gold hammer trousers. Pants, yeah. I think I'd go biker shorts and just kind of avoid people that day. Yeah, and just be like, oh, and just put like, glasses on. Nobody look at me. <laughs> Bouncing <laughs> on my bike. Would you rather never be able to fill in your eyebrows or only use a sharpie to fill them in? So hard, because I'm such an eyebrow girl. You are too, aren't yeah. you? Yeah. I feel like my face is never really complete unless I've done my eyebrows. I... It's the second thing I do. I do my makeup like an order of importance. I know that sounds really weird, but I do foundation, then my eyebrows, and like I could never even put on eye makeup until my eyebrows are done. I would have to fill them with a sharpie and just be like, use little strokes. Yeah, as long as it wasn't like a red sharpie or or a green one. Okay, if we... even black would look bad, I think, wouldn't it? Yeah, I think if we were given a brown sharpie, we could probably work with it, and it might last a few days, so you don't have to do your eyebrows. Why don't we do don't... this? Yeah, we should actually try this. Last one. Would you rather never ever pluck your eyebrows, or never shave your legs? Well, I have this one really easy because my eyebrows never need plucking, so they don't grow very much. So I would just be able to shave my legs. <laughs> What would you do, honestly? My brows get very unruly, so I think it would look bad, but then I don't think there'd be as much, like... They didn't say you can wax your brows. They didn't say you can wax your legs. Yeah. Or laser hair removal. We'll get around that one, guys. So. We've, we've managed to like get around all of them pretty yeah. much. Yeah. Um, if, I, if it really came down to it, I'd probably have to say, in the summer, I would have to shave my legs. In the winter, I'd have to pluck my eyebrows. Yeah. So that's yeah. all of the ones we're going to be answering on this channel. But if you want to see us answer eight more really funny would you rather beauty questions, yeah. click on Tanya's lovely face now. <laughs> Maybe um, you should do the bike face. <laughs> yeah. Hope you enjoyed it and I will see you very soon. Bye. Goodbye. Maybe I need glasses too. Do you want to try mine on? See if, yeah. see if you can see any better with them. Look how big they are! <laughs> <laughs> Hello everyone, I'm Tanya Burr. <laughs> so I'm going to do a makeup tutorial. Do you ever look at yourself upside down? You put your nose. Get a bit ruly at times. Or is it unruly? Unruly. Oh, no. <laughs> ruly, my brows get ruly. <laughs> my nostrils are really different shape. Mm. Look at my nostrils. Oh yeah. When I was a baby, the nurses said that I had nostrils like little hearts. Let me see again. Yeah. <laughs> I love that you're just like looking at my nose. <laughs> That's so cute. They are like heart. Yeah, they called me like heart nostril baby or something <laughs> weird. <laughs> We're going yeah. over some speed bumps. <laughs> Whoop. <laughs> Whoop. Where's my phone? Here. Oh, I'm, I'm sitting on it. <laughs> Disappeared up Tanya's bottom. <laughs>